Yeah. That's a very important thing, I think, in being a sound person is to, well, it's, it's to pick your battles a little bit, but also just to know, like, when it's good to say, when it's good to ask for things and when it's good not to ask for things, you know. And, I mean, certain scenes where, you know, sometimes things get very emotional and, like, you don't want to ask for a wild line or something when, you know, when the actors are really wound up and stuff, or whatever, you know, whatever I'm saying. It's just, so you have to sort of feel it out. Sometimes you know, yeah, today's not the day to ask for that. And then other days, it's fine, yeah, sure, let's do it. Or you can even say, you know, I really like to tell the director, I'd like to get wild lines for this scene, but I don't think this is the right time to do it. I know we have 17 pages to do today, but what about, like, on Thursday, maybe we could bring that actor back because it looks like a very light day. And the director will go, yeah, yeah, that's a good idea, yeah, that kind of thing. Yeah. So, so presenting just solutions straight away as opposed to just constantly being the problem of right. Yeah, that's a very, very good point. It's like you want to have a solution, not just a complaint. <laughs> You're like this is not working, but how about if we did that? You know. Yeah. Um, and uh, but of course, anyway, with wild lines, it's better to do them immediately after the scene because that's when the actors are most likely to be able to, to sort of imitate what they had done. But, whatever. And I do like wild lines. I mean, there's numerous times where I've gotten wild lines that are in the movie, and it's like, you know, I'll even have a scene where I really like the way pretty much everything sounds, except there's one line somebody bends over and they say it to their shoes, and I just think it sounds terrible. So I'm like, why don't we just, just give me a couple of those lines, and it'll drop right in. It's pretty much on their back when they bend down, and it'll be smooth and, you know. There's a, I know a specific incident of that in Benjamin Button where it worked out great. So, you know, 